Wholesome Playhouse is pleased to present another episode of Marie Hopper. Marie Hopper. Yeah, we'll do that. Thanks for calling. Bye. What a nice person. That was the best strong number I've ever had. That must be my bell. Lawrence Henderson. And the Brady Bunch. Come in. Uh, Marie, we can't stay. We're just passing through the neighborhood collecting old clothes to give to the Waltons. <laughs> well, surely you have time for a cold drink. What do you have? I have an assortment. Oh, Any kind of milk you want. <laughs> Any kind. <laughs> White, chocolate, Low fat, gold, and not to be sold after April 10th. I don't want any milk. Me neither. Girls. Well, you all certainly look healthy. How have you been, Bobby? <laughs> what was that? Oh, he's been like that ever since he had his tonsils out. Some crazy doctor gave him a Hammond organ transplant. <laughs> but the good news is that we found a replacement for Greg. Yes, Greg left us and moved to Milwaukee. He's gone to college? No, he's trying to get a date with Laverne and Shirley. <laughs> We've been trying to find a teenage boy to replace him. And we had to have someone wholesome enough to fit our image. <laughs> oh, that must be him now. <laughs> Hi. Would you mind not smiling so brightly? <laughs> wow, he looks so familiar. Well, maybe that's because I've had previous experience with a large family. Don't, don't tell me. Let me guess. Okay. Me guess. Uh, the Partridge family? No. Seven Brides for Seven Brothers? No, no, no. The Jackson Five? No. Uh, Marie, I'm sorry, but we, we have to keep his identity a secret. You understand. Oh. Yeah. Hey, we better hurry. They're having a sell on Mom's apple pie down at the store. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Anytime. Bye-bye. Hope you get well soon. <laughs> And now, here is a scene from the next episode of Marie Hartburn, Marie Hartburn. Wow, I'd better answer that. It may be another wrong number. 